South Florida. News right now coming out of South Florida. Chopper 6 live right now. This is over the Star Island home of rapper P. Diddy, where four law enforcement sources tell NBC News that a search warrant has been executed by federal agents with Homeland Security investigations. Now we're hearing another search warrant has been executed at his home in Los Angeles. Now at this point, it's unclear why. We know that the rapper, whose real name is Sean Combs, has faced accusations of sex trafficking in recent months. Last year, singer Cassie sued Combs, accusing him of abuse. That lawsuit was settled, but more women later sued, accusing Combs of sexual abuse. NBC6's Christian Cologne is on the way to the scene and will bring us a live report coming up. Hey, you guys, welcome back. Let's talk Diddy's homes. All of his homes were raided. L.A., New York, and Miami, all raided by federal agents. Dozens of heavily, heavily armed federal agents conducted the raids. News footage shows dozens of agents from the Department of Homeland Security executing the search warrant. Okay, it is going down. People inside the home were handcuffed. I believe I see Justin Combs, Christian Combs, and Christian Combs' girlfriend. All of them were driven away from the property. That's right. They were arrested. Now, where's Diddy? Where the hell is Diddy? Diddy's on the run. Because how do you leave your kids behind? He knew they were coming. He knew they were coming because Diddy has a lot of police officers in his freaking pockets. Okay? How much do you want to bet? They gave him a heads up. Diddy is definitely hiding. Now, let's get back to the raids. All the raids were coordinated to occur at the same time this afternoon. Guys, they shut down the entire area. There were police helicopters swarming up above, at least two choppers. There were a lot of police on the ground. It was going down. A rep for Homeland Security Investigations said earlier today, Homeland Security Investigations... HSI New York executed law enforcement actions as part of an ongoing investigation with assistance from HSI Los Angeles, HSI Miami, and our local law enforcement partners. We will provide further information as it becomes available. This case is being handled out of the Southern District of New York. Reports say this appears to be tied to SEX trafficking allegations, okay? TMZ obtained additional footage that shows federal agents rolling up to Diddy's via water. You guys, the video shows armed agents standing on a boat. And I have the videos for you guys, so check this out. <laughs> You're guilty, guilty by association. <laughs> Department of Homeland Security conducting a raid at a house in Holmby Field Hills, believed to be connected to Sean Combs, the rapper and music executive, perhaps being linked to a sex trafficking investigation. He got some shots of a few people coming out of the home. Those people have been detained. Now we're trying to still connect the dots. We do have some sources on scene here that we're getting this information from. We were actually the first ones here with about 30 different law enforcement vehicles at least. There are three Bearcats on scene here. This just all unfolded, Sandra, I would say, less than 10 minutes ago. We got here even before the crime scene tape came up. So uh, we're just down the hill. If you look up the street where Tony is right now to the right, you'll see one of those Bearcats and law enforcement. On the other side of those bushes, basically, is that home that is registered to Bad Boy Films, which is part of Bad Boy Entertainment. And the home in particular is registered not only to Bad Boy Films, but to one of P. Diddy's daughters. We did see a bunch of investors 
investigators going in, making the raid in there and clearing that as well. So they're gonna do a thorough search as they conduct this raid. And so far, Stu, from what I understand and from Haley on the ground there, they have not seen and we have not seen from our vantage point any sign of Sean Combs, the 54 year old who is believed to be the property owner of this. They are gathering information, talking to the folks who are there on the property, as well as going through the home. It wasn't as heightened as we saw just 10 minutes ago when they actually got onto the property. Well, definitely a little bit more relaxed as far as the investigators that you see right there. And now we're getting more of a count. Uh, you can see that there's four, maybe five people down there, six uh, total that they have removed from the home. A couple of them still in cuffs. We don't know what exactly they're looking for, who they're looking for. But again, this could possibly be linked to a sex trafficking investigation involving rapper Sean Combs, the music executive. But as you heard from Haley right there, she believes and she's been hearing that we do not think that Sean Combs is on that property at home right now. He may be in New York as this raid is being conducted. But we do know from our reporting that over the course of the year already, just as early as March this year, there have been several lawsuits filed against Sean Combs. So clearly this could be part of it. We are not sure at this. Bad boy, bad boy. What you gonna do? What you gonna do when they come for you, daddy, daddy? What you're gonna do is take that, take that when they come for you. <laughs> so there you have it, you guys. So yeah, it's going down. Diddy is on the run and his sons are arrested. Okay? I bet he wishes he had paid off Cassie because it's been downhill from there. This is the year of reckoning. You guys, it's going down and I'm here for it. Diddy needs to go down. Who is next? Because evil will never win. Evil will not win. No, 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 no. We have to expose evil. We have to expose and shed lights. Okay? So thank you guys for tuning in. Please hit the like button. Please share this video and please subscribe for more. Thank you. Peace.